Today, I'm going to build a web application with the Big Top Code Generator targeting the Gantry framework. The app will be called Address, and it'll have a single table to start called Family. Big Top's now made the application, and I'll just follow its instructions for starting it up. First, changing into the directory, then creating the database from the schema file that it generated, and then I can start the application. But it's a command. I'm going to tell Unix. Now it's giving me URLs and I'll just copy one of those and paste it into my browser. It gave me two choices. I'll take the first one and then I'll show you the family table. But I'm not really ready to put data into the application yet. I want to expand it. So I'll tell BigTop to add to that description a new table called birthday with a foreign key to the family table. Big Top is now expanding the application. I do have to throw away the database. I'd worry more if I had data in it. And recreate it. And restart the app server. Now you can see there's an extra link. And when I reload, you'll see that in the site navigation links. And now I'll go ahead and put some data in. I'll say that I want to keep track of my friends Sam and Sarah Smith. And I'll just give them a dummy phone number. And I'll say that they just had a baby, and I'll keep track of that baby's birthday. The baby's name is Susan, and she was born in July. And then I'll just associate her with her parents and save. The longer movie will go on to show how to change the column names, add additional columns, and we'll give a tour of the code that is generated by BigTop 